guys what's up my name is maya and welcome to my channel if you do not know me and this is your first time clicking on one of my videos welcome girl hey go ahead and hit that subscribe button join the family join the gang and if you're a returning subby returning subscriber returning watcher hey girl welcome back you already know the vibes go ahead and hit that subscribe button i mean go ahead and hit that like button so today i am in the car as y'all can see and i'm driving i'm on my way to my nail appointment i think i'm going to vlog today i have a few things to do and i'm gonna be taking myself out on a date it's gonna be like a little lunch day i'm going to um i really want to go to this restaurant it's one of my favorite restaurants it's called connor's so i plan on going there and um i'm going to the movies because I don't really have friends and my friends don't like the same type of movies that I like so I was like okay I never did anything like this before girl let's just go take yourself out enjoy your own company so I'm gonna go to the movies I'm going to go um yeah to the movies I'm gonna go to uh eat lunch and I'm sorry if I'm talking weird but I have these aligners in my mouth and they make me sound kind of funny so yeah but right now i'm going to my nail appointment i'm actually late i'm supposed to be there at 10 o'clock and it is 9 47 a.m so yeah i gotta hurry and go there and yes i'll hit y'all up when i get there see y'all guys later bye Alrighty guys, so I am out of the nail salon and let me tell you this lady I have never had her before she's never did my nails before but She was the absolute sweetest person like she was so sweet. Her name was my You know, my name is Maya. So, you know, that was I was like, okay, okay girl And this is what I got just a little basic um, Can y'all see that? A little basic set really like pink with a white um lining it's so cute and i got some white nail uh my toes are white so yeah i hate these freaking aligners i literally cannot talk but anyway so now i have to go to the bank and the movie starts at 3 40 so i probably won't i probably won't be going to eat i might go i might eat afterwards so it might turn into dinner instead of lunch i don't know i just gotta see like the time or i might just grab like some panera or something like that before i go so hmm yeah i'm about to go to the bank and if i have time i want to go to the car wash today but I gotta see if I have time. I don't know. But yeah, we are about to go. And I'm going to hit y'all up when I get to my next destination. Hey, bye. Okay guys, so I am back and I have vacuumed my car as much as I could, but definitely on my next off day, I have to literally make an appointment to get my whole car detailed because my back seats, I did not know that they were that bad. And it's just, it's clean, but baby, it's not clean. Like I want that new car feel, but until then, this is gonna have to do. So I got these Glade, um, the wind, the, review mirror things and i'm going to it's a four pack i got it from walmart and i know these smell good because i literally have these same exact um 
plugins at home as we speak. So, yep, I'm gonna put one up. I'm thinking, should I put one or two? I'm gonna just put one and see how that does. And if it does good, then I'm going to keep keep one. And if they don't, you know, give what I'm what it's supposed to give, then I'm gonna put another one. But then I have this um car spray in the scent, but Hawaiian blue. Oh, I thought I got the coconut one. I hope this smells good. I'm just one, two, three. And these sprays you don't need a lot, so Hopefully it's not too strong. And this is gonna stay in my middle part. So yeah, we are all done. Let me show y'all the car. Hold on. y'all how about i've been sitting talking to y'all this whole time and literally it was not recording but like i was saying before i realized that the freaking camera was not even recording anything i just left out of bluff city soap and they had some really great things in there but i wasn't trying to spend too much money and like the bars of soap smell really good but they're seven dollars a bar and the last time i got them like i went and bought like four bars of soap none of the bars was hitting the way that they were supposed to like i'm talking about none of them no moisture no nothing like you didn't even smell like the soap when you got out the shower so no but my cousin she had told me about the body butters that they had and i've been looking for a really thick whipped body butter and that's how they are in there and they smell so good. I got coconuts and hold on. Coconut and 99 problems. Now, this 99 problems, girl, when I tell you, it smells so good in the store. I hope, like I am hoping and praying that it smells the same way. Because I got the shower oil and I got the um body butter. So I'm hoping that miss girl over here she smells the way that she smells in the store because baby it smells so good and i got coconut coconut smells so good and i got so many coconut um washes and stuff at home so yeah but i am at the movies right now so we are about to go in get the ticket maybe get a little snack before i think when the movie is over that's when i'm gonna go and get some dinner and i'm probably just gonna go home because ain't really nothing else to do so I'm gonna talk to y'all when the movie is over and I'm gonna let y'all know how it was. So yeah, I'm gonna call y'all back. All right guys, so I am back and I just left out of the movie theater and the movie was pretty good. I give it like an eight, maybe a seven and a half out of 10 i wasn't really happy on how the movie ended it was not even what i thought it was going to turn out like like literally it i don't know i don't know if it had a good message to me it did but at the same time it did it but it was really good um it was the moments where you know i shed a few tears um so yeah i would recommend going to see it you know just to give your own personal opinion on it but so far i liked it um you know sometimes you gotta watch a movie a few times just to you know see if that's really how you feel about it so i think i will see it again but i wouldn't like go to the movies i would wait until like it came out on like Hulu or something like that and then watch it but overall it was a really good movie but now I am about to go to Barnes and Noble and Trader Joe's I really need to go to Walmart too but I don't know if I'm gonna go to Walmart yet um 
I might go tomorrow or something like that. I'm not sure. It just depends on how I'm feeling because I still haven't. Sorry about that. It just depends on how I'm feeling because I still haven't ate. I ate some nachos and had like half of the icy in the movies, but I'm still kind of hungry. Still don't know what I want, but girl, yes. We are about to go to Trader Joe. Well, I'm gonna go to, um, what did I say? Barnes and Noble first, and then I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's. Um, my body butter literally melts it in the car, so I hope it, you know, when it hardens back up, I hope it's solid because it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's done for. It's like literally oil, it's, it's melted. So I'm gonna hope for some good things. But yeah, I will let, I will hit y'all back up. I was gonna say I'll let y'all know. <laughs> I'll hit y'all back up when I get inside of um Barnes and Noble. So yeah. Okay, y'all, so I am now at home. I have been to Trader Joe's. What all did I do today? I literally it's like 8 30 i literally been out all day long y'all so i'm just now at home in my pajamas i took a shower all of that so um i went to buff city so i went to trader joe's i went to barnes and noble went to the movies and i ended up getting some chinese food so i just want to show y'all you know everything that i got today so we're gonna start off with the Buff City soap and I got this body butter which I told y'all earlier it literally melted but it smells so good when I smelt it in the store and it's the 99 problems and it is um dang it it doesn't even tell like what it's supposed to smell like and then I got shower oil that matches it let's see if that one smells oh y'all cannot wait when I tell y'all I cannot wait to literally try to oh, then I have the um coconut oil one and I'm in the kitchen I don't know why I decided to do this in the kitchen. I don't know let me see if I can open it and show y'all because oh yeah it's starting to harden back up the lighting is terrible in here but let's see oh it's it's whippy oh my god y'all this smell y'all i ain't even put it on my whole body i just put it on my hands like I literally put it on my hand and it like the smell. I just know once I get in the shower, spray the oil on me and oh my God, I'm gonna smell so freaking good. I'm, I'm literally gonna smell so good y'all. So I didn't even try this yet, but I already know that it's gonna be a 10 out of 10. So if y'all have a Buff City soap, this is what the bag looks like. Y'all have a Buff City soap in y'all area go go check them out period okay so next is the Barnes and noble i got miss tabitha brown y'all i read the first page of this i read the back and then i read the first page and it sold me and this was um 27.99 plus tax so 13 i mean 13 <laughs> So $30, but I'm pretty sure this book is going to be so good. I cannot wait to read it. And then I got this book also by Zane. It's called Sex Chronicles. So we're going to see what that's about, you know. Here's my receipt. Yes, um, before taxes, it was $44.98. And the sales tax was $4.16. So I told it out to $49.14. literally fifty dollars on two books that i'm pretty sure is going to be amazing so i'm not even really tripping on that and then at Trader joe's i got some chinese food 
um, that my aunts were raving about. Spicy Thai shrimp fried rice. And I also got the um, Trader Joe's chicken fried rice. If any of my Trader Joe's shoppers are watching and y'all have had any of these, please comment down below and let me know what you think. And then I had got this wine right here. So peach wine is called Love Olivia. Never heard of it. Never tried it. Hopefully it's good. And I also got oh, this peach Bellini wine from Trader Joe's. And this one was $4.99, $3.99. And this one was, uh, I'm going to say like $5.99. And this fried rice chilled these wines, I'm telling you. They got them cold. And I also, let me put these in the refrigerator real quick. Ooh, this one is in the fridge. Okay. And I also got some flowers. And I have my vase right here. And we're going to make this arrangement. Oh, Lord. Or not. Okay. So, I got these little, I don't know, they was cute. So, they look really good. Let me put some water in this vase. And ignore the background, y'all. I gotta clean up. I literally have to clean up. So, let's put this little... Okay, together. Let's see. Oh Lord, I think I done got some wild flowers. Mm. Yeah, I don't know about these, baby, because these are a little wild. They were so pretty. Oh my God. What the fuck? Okay, I'm gonna put those down. Hold on. We don't connect to them. And then I got these. These are so cute. I thought these were really pretty. If I cut the stems on flowers, would it kill them? And I, I'm really asking, are these fake? No, these are real. Because I really don't know. Oh my God. Let me see. Put the flower food in the. Do I take these off? I don't know. I'm just going to. I never buy fresh flowers, but I want. I said that I wanted to start because they are just so cute and pretty. Oh, maybe I can just slot it. Maybe I can just slide it off. Yeah. So we're gonna put, I feel like these are too big for this vase. I don't know. Well, I know the ones that, the other ones that I got are gonna be like literally too short. Oh my God, this is terrible. I really wanted to have like a very cute, Oh no, come on. Y'all, are this, is this supposed to be like this? Like, look how, should I cut the stems? Can I cut the, I'm gonna just, I don't wanna kill the flowers if I cut the stems. I feel so crazy. I don't kill these flowers because they're so pretty. Oh, look at that. That's so much better. Move, Coco. And then these are like super duper small. So I know that these are literally not going to make it. I don't even know what I was thinking. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, I'm feeling so crazy right now. I'm like, these like super long and super pretty, and then these are all short. Like, look how small. <laughs> Y'all, look how small these are. What was I thinking? Uh, Miss Girl, what are these going to do? Uh, but I was thinking, like, the pink. Hold on. We're going to put them in there, though. Oh, they might be cute. Hold on. These are. These look freaking terrible. Oh, they kind of cute though. Oh my god, the leaves are falling. camera keep on falling y'all oh my god stay but I'm trying to figure out what to do with these right here oh my god I'm gonna take all the stems why are you back there doing all of that like this was supposed to be pretty and it's, it's, it's not it's not given uh, but I thought it was, oh my, no. These mothers are going to trash. Okay, so this is the bouquet. It was supposed to be pretty, but it's given very much Easter, very much a funeral. Okay, guys, so that wraps up the end of this vlog. I am about to eat and watch a movie and maybe start my book tonight. I'm not sure, depending on how late it is, because I do have to work tomorrow. But if you enjoyed this video and want more vlogs like this in the future, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below. And like I said, if y'all tried any of those things from Trader Joe's or Shop at Buff City Soap, let me know down in the comments what y'all think about um, the products and what's your favorite products to use and um, items to buy. So yes. Thank y'all so much for tuning in and I will see y'all next time. Bye.